Actually, this video shows how you can bounce a till at the end of the day. So first of all, you're going to want to come into sales history. And I've got a filter set for where the invoice date is today. And I'm going to hit print, all, a report called sales by payment method. So this is what you want you expect to find in your drawer. So this will be the cash you should find, the Visa, MasterCard, American Express, and the amount you put on receivables. So I'm just going to push that aside. Now I'm going to go into sales, cash out. And here's where you'll now actually count the items out of the till. So uh, my report says I've got 5,134.10 in cash. So let's assume I've got that correct. So I've got 50. One hundred dollar bills, a twenty, a ten, and a two. So fifty one thirty two two. So fifty one thirty four. Okay, I'll, I'll actually have to say fifty one thirty four ten, but let's just leave it out of balance for a moment. Then we're going to now choose how much of my credit cards. So Mastercard, according to the report we did. And normally, when read off, straight off the report, you want to count the slips to make sure it's correct. But forty six. 43.52. My visa equals 22.39 and 45. And my American Express is 18.76. Okay, so that's completed. So I'll just go print now and print my cash out report. So it says here there's all my amounts that I just, those are the ones I typed in. These are the ones that came from the sales, looks at the sales methods, the payment methods and sales. So it shows an amount of balance by 10 cents. So I go back to my till, figure out where my cash problem is. And I, ah, here's a, a, a dime that I forgot to count. So I add the dime to it, hit the print preview, and I'm in balance. So that basically shows you uh, how to cash out your cash till at the end of the day.